the baby sister girl. Good morning. Mom, you have time for breakfast? No, I'll have it tonight. That will make it dinner. Oh, right. I don't know what I'm saying. It's finals week. I am totally crazy, and I'm running late for my study group. Let's see, do I have everything? Law books, lecture notes, legal briefs, with the lollipop stuck to it. Uh, that's CC's. We were looking all over for it. Is there a candied apple in there? Saria, you promised to help me out this week with Cece. You gotta do a better job of watching her. I can't have any distractions this weekend, okay? I really need to study. Mom, don't worry. Michael and I have everything under control. Oh, I know, I know. I knew I could count on you guys. Yeah, we got your back, Mom. Oh, thanks, sweetie. <laughs> Bye. Bye-bye. Morning. Morning. Michael, where's Cece? You're supposed to be getting her dress for school. Yeah, well, I tried, but she said that everything I picked out for her was a fashion no-no. You didn't let her dress herself. Yeah, why not? Maddie! And you were worried. Come on. at me. You didn't expect me to eat it, did you? You started a food fight. Now we're in trouble. Don't sweat it. Leo's cool. You call the principal Leo? Well, not to his face. To his face, I call him your supreme majesty. <laughs> well, I hope my dad lets you sleep over tonight, because he's going to be really mad. Mine won't. Why not? He doesn't live with us anymore. My parents are divorced. Why did they get divorced? It was all my fault. I kept getting in trouble. Like we are now? <laughs> yep. They'd get mad, yell at me, yell at each other. Then they stopped yelling. That's good. No, that's bad. They stopped talking to each other. When I asked them what was wrong, they said, everything's fine. That's good. <laughs> no, that's bad. So the next thing you know, they said, son, you better sit down. Now that's Bad. No, that's good. Because <laughs> at least they were talking to each other again. That's good. <laughs> no, because then they ended up fighting over who was going to get me. <laughs> Is that bad or good? Nicholas Peterson? No, that's bad. <laughs> Honey, I know you're trying to study, but we've got to talk about somebody's poor behavior. All right, man, I'm sorry. I siphoned some gas out of your car because I needed two bucks worth to get to work. <laughs> Not you. <laughs> Nicholas got sent to the principal's office today. Nicholas, what happened? Well, it's actually kind of funny. <laughs> you know how most fish sticks are soft and they don't really hurt when they bounce off your head? <laughs> Nicholas, get to the point. Well, I got in a food fight. Nicholas, come on, man. With fish sticks? I'm ashamed of you. I know. These shoes corn dogs, man. <laughs> you can make them curve once at school, man. I got this corn dog stuck in this guy's ear, man. We call him corny, man. He's crazy. <laughs> Wendell, are... Wendell. That's why they don't let you teach at that school anymore. <laughs> Nicholas, just for this, Arnie will not be staying the night over here. Now go upstairs and change. Yes, ma'am. Honey, we already promised Arnie's mother. Well, just unpromise her. We can't unpromise what we said. Yes, we can. Just pick up the phone and do it. They'd get mad, yell at me, yell at each other. I know you're under a lot of pressure, but I don't want to fight about this, okay? Neither do I. I just don't have the time. Thank you, Juan. <laughs> Window in marriage, it's not about winning or losing. So you lost. Gia, Porky, giddy up! Gia, Porky, giddy up! Ah. I said giddy up. What kind of horsey are you? 
kind that wants to be shot. Cece, don't you want to read a book? No. Color? Boring. Ooh, let's take a nap. Boinger. Well, what do you want to do? Let's play Scream King. How do you play that? Oh, stop. It's great. You win. You're the king. Oh, you know what? I have a great idea. Come here. Why don't we play hide and seek? Oh, excellent. Good idea. Yeah. Now, Cece, you go hide. Okay, okay. While Michael and I close our eyes and count to ten. Million. Uh. <laughs> Come in peace. Robert, I'm sorry, baby. I'm sorry, too. I'm sorry. <clears throat> you were right. Arnie's mother's all by herself now, and knowing Arnie, I'm sure she could use a break. Man, don't worry about Nicholas. I grounded him for two weeks, and he's writing a letter of apology to the cafeteria lady for getting the tartar sauce in her hairnet. <laughs> Thank you. So you just study, and I'll make dinner. OK? okay? I won't talk to you, and you won't talk to me. They stop talking to each other. Is anything wrong? Everything's fine. I asked them what was wrong, and they said everything's fine. Nicholas, is there something you want? Oh, right. Is fish stick one word or two? It's two. No, I, I believe it's one word. No, 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 honey, it's two. No, I'm absolutely sure it's one word. No, no, I'm absolutely positive it's two words. Don't fight, don't fight. I'll just call it the thing I hit you in the head with. <laughs> That shower was heaven. About time. Any hot water left in the city? Uh, not if I can help it. I'll take Cece now. Uh, Cece? Yes, Cece, our sister. You know, she's short, cute, great screamer, man. Yes, I know who Cece is, but I, I thought she was with you. I thought she was with you. No, I was working on my music. Uh... Ooh, it's been over two hours. She's still hiding. Oh, we better find it before Mom and Dad do. Okay, CC, uh, ready or not, here we come. <laughs> hey, little partner. What's up? I'm just looking at some pictures of Mom and Dad's wedding. Now, that was a party. Hey, who's the skinny guy in this funny suit? Hey, that suit's not funny, and that skinny guy is me. <laughs> Sorry. That was my Al Green suit. I wore that to your parents' wedding. I stood up and sang, let's stay together. <laughs> the choir jumped me. I wish you had sung that better. That's what the choir said. <laughs> no, I mean, I wish Mom and Dad could stay together. What are you talking about, Nick? Wendell, I've got something terrible to tell you. You guys already ate dinner, man? No. Mom and Dad may be getting a divorce. But you sure you ain't ate dinner? <laughs> you serious about this, huh? Because it's true. Nick, your mom and dad love each other. They're gonna be together forever, man. But if you're serious about it, I'll check it out for you. Thanks, partner. <laughs> no problem, man. Now, let's get this straight. You sure y'all ain't ate dinner?
Uh, don't mind me. I just uh, misplaced something. Michael, what are you looking for? Uh, nobody. I mean, uh, I mean, nothing. How's, how's everything going with Cece? Oh, it's great. It's like, uh, it's like she's not even there. <laughs> Michael, tell me what you want. Maybe I've seen it. Oh, I'm sure you probably have. I'd just like you to see it again. Michael! No, no. Honey, I, I'll, I'll talk to them. I'll talk to them. Oh, no, it's not their fault. I just need to get out of this house. Why don't I take the kids and you get the house? Well, we've got to do something because this just isn't working. I'll take out. the kids. I'll take the kids. <laughs> what are you, Kay? What did you find out? Little partner, I think you better sit down. The next thing you know, they said, son, you better sit down. Doesn't look so good. They ended up fighting over who is going to get me. He's gonna live with me. No, me. Let go of him. You let go of him. I want him. I want him. No! Well, the partner might be right. Your parents may be splitting up. Yeah, them and me. <laughs> But don't worry, little partner, because when my parents were thinking about splitting up, I kept them together. How? I told my mother I was going to stay with her, and I told my father I was going to stay with him. After that, they stick together like glue. Wow, a kid could do that? What well, kid? I was 29. <laughs> well, I hope I can get my mom and dad to stay together. Whatever you need, partner, I'm there for you. Thanks, Wendell. Because if they split up, I have no place to go. No place to eat. <laughs> no place to borrow things. <laughs> no place to eat. Ah! Wonder what about me? Me, me, me. That's all you say, man. You're selfish, man. Think of others. <laughs> Hi, Daddy. Are you playing, too? Playing what? Hiding seek, but Michael and Zaya never seeked me. <laughs> Is that so? She's not in my room. No, I need her. Let's check Mom and Dad's room. Okay. Hey! Whoa! Hey. Hey. What's up, guys? Nothing. Nothing. Everything's cool, you know? Oh, where's Cece? I need to talk to her. She's, She's sleeping. Back. I mean, she's sleeping in the bathtub. Which can be dangerous, so I'll go check on her. Yeah, no, no I'll, I'll go check. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. <laughs> well, that Cece's a handful, huh? Oh, tell me about it. <laughs> Cece, uh, is everything okay in there? Uh, I'm fine, Daddy. Why don't you sing that song that you always sing in the tub? Uh, I got soap in my mouth. Oh, uh, come on and sing it for Daddy. Come on, rubber ducky. Uh, da Cece, why don't you sing Rubber Ducky for Dad so he can leave in peace? Only if Michael sings it with me. Huh, a duet. Okay, uh, two, three, four. I love my Rubber Ducky, it's my favorite toy. I always bring him with me, he brings me so much joy. He goes quack, 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 quack. quack. Okay, so uh, I guess we'll just go back to our rooms and uh, unplug the phones and the TVs and not see natural light for a really, really long time. Can I do it, Dad? Uh, that's a start. Wanna watch cable? Nah. 
Mm, belching contest? <laughs> uh, uh, lie here and stare at the ceiling? Yeah. <laughs> that was a joke. But what? <laughs> Nicholas, what's wrong with you? I think my mom and dad may be getting a divorce. Join the club. They used to be so happy. My parents were happy once. Really? Mm, nah, just trying to relate. <laughs> this is all my fault. I've got to get them back together. That's not easy. They'd have to fall in love all over again. How do I do that? I could hit on your mom and make your dad jealous. <laughs> nah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, Robert. Did I wake you? I, mean, I thought you were studying downstairs. Nick and Arnie are downstairs, and I really needed to study. Uh, you know what? Why don't I go downstairs and just bunk with the guys? Oh, sweetheart, you don't have to do that. Here, oh. there's a pillow. <laughs> Yet leave everything to me. <laughs> Mom, these flowers are from Dad. This is a feather duster. It's a dot that counts. <laughs> and here's a little bubbly for you two lovebirds. <laughs> bubbly? Yeah. <laughs> we'll save that for later. Nicholas, is this going to get any stranger? Ah, uh, somebody. <laughs> Stop singing and start talking. Uh, what's going on here? I'm just trying to bring back the magic. With that fine fitting suit. <laughs> this is a suit I wore to you guys' wedding. I thought you rented that. Uh-oh. <laughs> Wendell, what's going on? Nick filled me in on everything. We know you guys are about to split up, but we're not going to let that happen because you love her and she loves you, and it's not an ordinary love. It's a mate, 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 mate. Wait, 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 wait. We are not splitting up. Let that be a lesson to y'all. You stay out of grown folks' business. Nicholas, did you think we were getting a divorce? Uh-huh. Where did you get that idea? Because I got in trouble, you guys started fighting, and then when I asked you what's wrong, you said everything was fine. That's because everything is fine. Boy, are you guys in denial. <laughs> uh, Nicholas, Arnie, grown-ups get divorced for grown-up reasons, mm -hmm. and even when they break up, they still love their children. That's what I was trying to tell you, little fellas. <laughs> Wendell, Nicholas, the next time something like this comes up, come to me and your mother, OK? OK. And the same thing goes for you, Wendell. <laughs> Whatever, I just want to get out of the suit. I'm starting to feel like the Hulk. <laughs> I wish I could have been at your wedding. It looks so cool. Oh, sweetie, it was wonderful. Your father was so handsome. And your mother was so beautiful. Mm -hmm. You still are. I'd marry you again today. OK, let's get out of here. Let's give the newlyweds some privacy. Come on, let's get out of here, man. You know, you can only study so much. <laughs> Y'all so nasty. <laughs> Linda, would you do? I'm so in love with you. Whatever you want to do is all right with me. Yeah.
yeah. Is this You Can Look Like Al Green Tuxedos? <laughs> yeah, this is Wendell Wilcox. Uh, what's your late charge? <laughs> Um, 1978. $42,000? You've been looking for me. You don't even know my name. You ain't got to use that kind of language. You ain't got to use that kind of... Ma'am. 